What's up guys, welcome to Daily Refinement. My name is Chris, thank you so much for joining me. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, I have 13,000 items in my store. Um, this week, I've done about $12,000 in sales on eBay, and um, $12,013 actually, and 43,000 so far this month. And today I wanna to go over a blueprint to earn $1,000 a week profit on eBay. So let's get straight into the content. I actually made this list on Instagram um, so follow me at Daily Refinement on Instagram. 500 people already downloaded this free blueprint, so hop on there and download it. And I'll show you guys the math in just a second for how this works, but the too long didn't read version of this is if you list $500 with the revenue every day for 180 days, uh, you'll make $1,000 a week at that point. So I'll show you guys that in this calculator. So this is my field guide. Um, you can buy it in the, in the description below for 35 bucks or for 35 bucks, you can join my Facebook group with Tech and Sports, and we will mentor you um, all the way um, through this process. If you guys don't know Tech and Sports, if you just Google him and look up his eBay store, um, he has 32,000 items in his store, and he's been doing this for over a decade at a very, very high level, um, and he's at almost four times the volume of me. So just to give you an idea, um, we've been both doing this for a while, and we're we're really doing it. You can look at our stores. Um, the last two weeks for me has been have been a little bit slower because I just had my first baby. Um, so I haven't been as active as much the last couple of weeks. But now I'm on nighttime daddy duty. So um, you're gonna be getting videos from me in the middle of the night and I have some kind of some time to um, work on eBay and YouTube in the middle of the night. So let me go over this, this math with you guys. So. Somebody posted earlier that 20 items is a lot. It is a lot, but I would consider it a full-time effort. Okay, so yes, you don't have to do 20 items a day. In this calculator, you can do one item a day. So in the beginning, if you're spending $750 on an item and selling it for $2250, it's going to take you a while to get one sale if your items take six months to sell or longer. But let's assume you're really picky when you just get started and you want to buy items that sell within one month and you double your money and you want to buy something for $750 and sell for $2250. Very reasonable amount. You can get this at a thrift store. My entire store is full of stuff like this. You can buy really cheap between $1 and $10 and sell for between $15 and $30. Just common items. So that being said, you could start with just one, but I don't consider one item a day a full-time effort. One, time, one item a day is just starting. So if you're just starting, you're gonna have just starting income. There's a lot of people who want full-time income with a just starting effort. There's no such thing as that. It always equals that. One of the, the best sayings that people have been quoting from Tech and Sports is, if you want a full-time income, you need a full-time effort. Okay, I personally wanna make $365,000 a year on, on eBay profit. So. I'm making a larger effort, I'm making a ridiculously large effort to do that, okay? In fact, it's not even possible to do that in one day with one person um, in my category. Sure, if you're selling luxury watches or something high-end, you could probably do it, but in my category of common clothing, I would not be able to, to sell uh, $365,000 of profit by myself a year. It's just too much work. So that being said, I consider 20 items a full-time effort, okay? So listing 20 items a day at 750, it's gonna take you four or five hours to list, ship, do all the processing. Anyone that tells you it's gonna take less time than that is probably lying to you because it's gonna take longer than that, especially when you're getting started. You might only be doing one listing an hour when you start, but that's okay. You're gonna get used, and, and that's when you're starting, give yourself some grace because you just started. No one who just played, just started playing the piano is gonna magically know how to play the piano. It takes time. Everyone, you need to at least learn some scales. You gotta learn some music theory and figure out how chords work, and that's how you would to learn how to play the piano. No one can just sit down and play the piano immediately. It takes a little bit of effort, um, and you know, <laughs> if you're like a, a symphony orchestra player like Tech and Sports, with 35,000 items, it's it looks easy, it's, it makes a beautiful sound, but really, in the beginning, it, it, it sounds like cats dying, okay? Your store is gonna sound like cats dying in the beginning because you don't know what you're doing, and that's okay. So, 
Let's assume you're giving a full-time effort. You just quit your job. You've got $10,000 saved. Um, and if you don't have at least $10,000 saved, please do not quit your job because it takes a while to break even. Just let me give you this example. Let's say you do quit your job and you're spending $750 an item at the thrift store. With new items, it costs a lot more to buy them. So let's just say you're thrifting the whole thing. You can see here, um, you're investing, uh, let's say it takes six months to sell. So just to start at the beginning, the first day you go to the thrift store, you buy 20 items, you spend 150 bucks. You're gonna be spending $150 every day now because you're replenishing 20 items into the store. So you have to spend money to make money. Here, this total invested amount, is gonna show you you're spending $150 a day for the entire year, okay? So over the course of 365 days, you spend $54,750. But, okay, what happens if you just keep reinvesting the profit? I'll show you what happens. So, $150 in the beginning, you're not gonna get a regular, sale, regular sales until the ninth day. So on the ninth day, you'll have 180 items in your store and you'll be selling about one item a day. If you do this plan, I would be very surprised if you blinked, meaning you didn't have a sale. It's, it's pretty much impossible because you're listing 20 new items a day and you already have 180 items in your store. So it doesn't take that long to start getting regular sales, but you've invested $1,350. So you can do reselling with no money, but it's, it's kind of um, unrealistic because some items don't sell and some items take longer to sell so i'm assuming six months to sell an item that's very conservative but i just want to show you guys around day 90 this is pretty interesting you will have spent six thousand six hundred and seventy five dollars of your own money into ebay but look what happens after that on the 91st day the amount that you have invested starts to shrink because you're you're making a little more money than the cost of the item and um, the profit coming back. So you actually start going the other direction. Look at day 91, the amount you've invested goes down $2, then $3, and then around month, around day 180, like I said in the Instagram example, you actually break even. So 180 days later, you have invested zero money. You get all, all 6,000 of your original money back in your pocket. So here you have the cash flow, right? You've reinvested that money back into your business now, and now it's producing a profit without you putting any additional money in. If you just left it inside here, you'd be making $150 a day, every day, which is $1,000 a week. This is the magic money number at 180 days you do have to spend some money to make money, but this is not this is not a crazy amount of money in my opinion, six grand, if you if you're if you're frugal. So like again, it, let's say that's unrealistic. We'll go down to five items a day. Now five items a day. Remember, five items a day is not a full time effort, so you will not get full time income. So you can see here the amount invested by day ninety is much less. So you've only spent one thousand six hundred and sixty eight dollars. Okay, and over the course of, let's see, it takes, it takes you two years versus six months at, at this pace. So if you only have your stimulus money to invest, $1,600, right? You can actually still make a full-time income in two years. That's amazing. With under $2,000, that's less than the cost of one college course, to be honest. So yes, you can do it with no money, but again, five listings a day is definitely not a full-time effort. Okay, there's people who do five listings a day during their lunch break. There's people who double dip and do five listings at work at work. Like they're doing five listings at work without their boss knowing. And they are stealing from their employer, but they can, you can do five listings in an hour if you, have all, if you already have the pictures, definitely, right? So, this is not a full-time effort. You will not get a full-time income. Please let me know where you can just put in a uh, hobby effort and produce a full-time income. That's, that's not how it works. Five listings a day is like maybe one to two hours. That's what people spend on Call of Duty. Okay, one to two hours a day. So like that, 
That's not going to get you into the league where you're making a million dollars. You've got to play Call of Duty's 19 hours. You got to play Call of Duty 19 hours a day to be competitive, right? If you did eBay for 19 hours a day, you you would be a millionaire in less than 10 years. Okay, so that's just the reality. So I appreciate you guys. Um, join the Patreon, patreon.com slash the resellers podcast. The link will be in the description below. If you join the uh, Facebook group of Tech and Sports and myself, you'll get my reseller field guide for free, which I just added this calculator so you can figure out how much money you need to build your dream business. Um, it'll also help you keep track of profit loss on multiple platforms. It's very easy to use. You just enter in all of your expenses um, and then you enter in all of your revenue and it will give you how much profit. It's an estimate estimation. I'm not a CPA, but I just put a simple four step plan to keeping track of your profit loss for people. Um, and I do recommend um, once you once you do get this to um, sign up for Mark II, my friend's um, tax planning course. Um, you can use code daily refine for 50 bucks off. He also has a $20 tax basics pamphlet that you can read. It's a, it's a really good ebook to get you an idea of how much you owe in taxes and you want to pay taxes. Okay. Because when you owe taxes, it means you made profit. So I wish everyone in this group listening right now, uh, a million dollar tax bill. Okay. So I want you guys to look at this plan, go to my Instagram, download it for free. If you want my field guide, um, it, it's a series of videos. Um, going over how I do it. I'm going to update it more because my processes have changed. My store is three times as big as when I started, when I made that guide. When I when I made that guide, I was making a full-time living. Now I'm making more than three times the full-time living on eBay. And Tekken Sports is making 10 times a regular living on, on eBay with, the, with a massive store. Oh, also, um, people were asking how my um, virtual assistants log into my computer. I use Chrome Remote Desktop. So eBay doesn't really like um, third parties um, pretty much across the board. So a virtual assistant logs into my computer when I'm asleep and makes drafts for me. So that's how um, I'm multiplying my time because like I said in some previous videos, in order for me to list 200 items a day, it takes 43 hours a day of work and I don't have 43 hours a day of work. So I have to use people to help me. So I have two virtual assistants and then two contractors that work here in person for me. So I am a single person corporation, single employee, and a single employee is me. So I pay myself a salary, the rest of it goes into my company, which I can take at the end um, of the year if I want. Um, but I'm a, I'm a single person corporation is how my company is set up with independent contractors who come and help me with photography and listing. And then my, my virtual assistants help me with drafting and editing photos. So I don't think you need edited photos. If you look at Tekken Sports' photos, they're just natural, but they do need to be bright and clear. Um, in my pictures, I, I delete the background, which gives it kind of a, um, you know, uh, the, my older pictures, I actually did not edit the photos. But I'll show you the re most recent ones. Um, now all my store photos look identical um, because I use the I use a, an app called Photo Room to delete the background. So um, this is just something new that I added, but uh, it takes a long time to edit the photos, so I hired a virtual assistant to do it. So you can build your plan however you want to do it. In fact, you can make a million dollars a year on eBay if you just do 20x this plan that I put in place here. So however you want to do it, there's somebody doing it. Um, but definitely as you, your process is tight, you can see most of my photos look exactly the same. Um, so that makes it a lot easier because if your pictures don't look exactly the same, it's hard to train someone to do it. Um, so hopefully that was useful guys. Please smash the like button, consider subscribing, um, join my Facebook group with Tekken Sports and you get the, the field guide for free with all the calculators. You get all my videos on how to do it. Um, I should charge a lot more than 35 bucks for the course, but I do think that this is going to be something that really would improve a lot of people's lives if they just execute these things. Um, it's a nine step plan, very straightforward. Go to my Instagram, grab it. Thank you everyone. Now I'm going to get some rest. Take care.